Hello and welcome to the TMC Newsroom. My name is Rich Tarani. Today we are at Interrupt New York 2010. On our program is Doug Odhout. He's a VP of Converged Infrastructure at HP. Hello, Doug. Hello, Rich. How are you doing? Great. So uh, the Converged Infrastructure, tell us what area that is within HP. Uh, converged Infrastructure is the combination of server, storage, and networking technology coming together. And our strategy is really about making it simpler to deploy the converged infrastructure, making it easier for people to run their applications on converged infrastructure. It's really about getting the efficiencies into the infrastructure that isn't there today because the technology that's deployed today is deployed in networking silos, server silos, and storage silos, and there's no efficiencies in between. And that's really our strategy is to put the efficiencies in between, make things that work better together so the IT managers and the application managers can become more productive. So, basically, you've probably seen over the last 10 years, the company's seen a lot of consolidation in the market where, where some of the competitors, let's say on the networking side, have evolved uh, into uh, supplying lots of different things, such as telepresence on one end, and on the other end, they're supplying servers. And so, we've seen that the entire computer industry and networking industry has um, seen a sort of consolidation where companies are trying to amass a portfolio of products and services that work seamlessly together. Correct. Correct. Right? And also, I guess, a single, they say single throat to choke for customers. They also want a single source vendor sometimes that make life easier for them. Correct. Correct. But one of the keys is if, as you bring the technologies together, is to make the products more efficient working together. So one example is, if you want to talk about networking, being able to put multiple protocols across one wire. So for example, iSCSI, fiber channel, as well as the internet traffic across one cable, right? Um, if you don't have a storage company and a networking company working together, you would never do that. Right. So that's why the silos have been there for so long. But now that the companies are you know, integrating or merging, what you're getting is these efficiencies between the technologies. That's where HP is really innovating is, how do I make it more efficient? How do I use one wire instead of four wires? How do I use multiple protocols instead of just using you know, different siloed machines, right? So if you see a product from us, whether it's a server product or a storage product, you can't really tell the difference from the outside because it's built on common building right. blocks, it's built with common interfaces, it just does something different. So right. the idea is build those efficiencies in between the silos and take the cost out, get it, make it more efficient. Now, uh, obviously this makes life easier for customers. Do they have any issues in terms of concerns of working with one vendor and then maybe not having the flexibility of uh, working optimally with another vendor that may not be within um, that family of, yeah. you know, from a single company. For example, let's say they go out and acquire, and they acquire a company that has infrastructure from a different company. What do they do? Okay, so um, our converged infrastructure is open. Uh, HP's been in the server business for 30 years. We work with Cisco, we work with EMC, we work with NetApps, we work with IBM servers, we work with Sun servers. Our objective is not to have a proprietary stack. Our objective is to make it more efficient. So a lot of our customers, you know, ask me, if I have your servers and your storage, but Cisco's networking, am I, am I on the road to convergence? And the answer is yes. If you used our networking, we can make it a little more efficient right. and make it more you know, productive, but you can use Cisco networking, or you can use EMC storage, or you can use IBM servers with our convergence. It's just right, a matter right. that the standards and the interfaces are open, and we can optimize a little more uh, amongst our groups, but we, we we're open to working with other people, and we will continue okay. to be open. Great. So in terms of uh, some of the new things you're working on, what can you share with us? Uh, new things we're working on, we just announced a whole new set of products around fiber channel over ethernet for both our networking and our server group. So now we can put you know, that protocol across a single wire. Uh, we announced our new mission critical uh, converged infrastructure, which is our new Superdome platform, uh, as well as our new storage platform. So now we can run mission critical applications and a converged infrastructure as well. So our Superdome is rack based, so we can put x86 blades next to a Superdome blade, next to a storage blade. So all in one enclosure, you have all the different types of operating systems you could ever want, and you can have storage and networking in the same infrastructure. So we're really making progress towards making converged infrastructure real this year and I'll announce a ton of products around that. Great, so um, one final question is, uh, if, if someone is out there thinking about purchasing from HP as opposed to one of the other competitive solutions, why would they pick your company? Oh, it's a simple question. Our stuff integrates very simply. We've done the integration work for you. So if you buy our stuff, when you go to deploy it, you'll, you'll be able to deploy it in minutes instead of days or weeks. For example, we can ship a pod in less than six weeks if somebody orders one. So we can ship a 40-foot 
uh, data center with all the servers, storage, and cooling in it in less than six weeks. Wow. It's, it's amazing when you, when you buy from us, we, we get it done very quickly and efficiently. That's great. Well, thanks for being on the program. Thank you. I appreciate it being here. Yeah, nice to meet you.